What's going on everyone? It's Ben with Buy It, Break It, Fix It, and thanks for tuning in today. I put a post the other day in the uh, community about doing a TRX4 Sport build-off with Axiomatic. So that's what, that's what we have in the plan. For the next five weeks, Axiomatic and I are going to go head-to-head with a TRX4 Sport build-off. What happened was, I got a hold of D&D Sports, and I, I told him our idea, and um, he is a hobby shop, so he, he stood right behind it. He was good to go, and uh, he's like, let me know what you need, and I'll get it in. So that's what we did. Axiomatic and I both sent him our list, and he got it in, and he shipped his big boxes. And this is my big box. It's already been cracked open a little bit. Rules. It has to be a stock motor and ESC. So no changing out any of the electronics like that. And then the second rule is it has to be Traxxas parts. All of it has to be Traxxas parts. Cannot put any parts on here, upgraded, aftermarket, anything like that. It has to be 100% Traxxas part. Has, it, we, we should be able to, to furnish a Traxxas part number for every part that we put on these trucks. So this will be the introduction of the build off. This will be week one. So we'll do the introduction and I'll show you the truck and all the parts that I got. Axiomatic will be putting out a video today too. He might have already beat me, but hopefully mine gets out first because everybody knows we're gonna win this. I mean, it's not a good, it's not a competition. We're just having fun. But um, I told Axiomatic from the beginning, I was like, look, get ready for some for some uh, boxing gloves back and forth. So, all right, so, um, and then next week. So every Wednesday, we'll put out a video that is in correlation to the build-off. So this week, I'll show you all the parts here in a little bit. We'll get into the box. And then next week, I'll show you the completion of the truck because I can't finish it all today. Um, I'll just show you a finished product. And then our first challenge, which will be a board climb. So an incline, incline, climb, is what our first challenge will be and if you want to know what the other challenges are you're gonna to have to tune in I personally will let you know what each challenge is going to be on the next following week um, I'm not gonna tell you now so you already know what next week's gonna be it's gonna be the board climb so let's get into the box and I'll show you what parts I got for my truck all right let's dig into this box and see what we got from D&D Sports all right, we got a Traxxas bag with a calendar in it. That is beautiful. Thank you, D&D. &D. Appreciate that. I can keep track of how the time is flying by. I can pick a different Traxxas car for each month. Ooh, D&D &D stickers, D&D &D swag. Yeah, yeah. I'll put that in the bag. All right, so we do have a blue TRX4 Sport. Ooh, a D&D &D card. D&D Sports. Let's plug him real quick. DndGameZone.com. Go check him out. Yep, yep. Go check out D&D. All right, so TRX4 Sport. Ooh, ooh, I forgot about this. Ooh, ooh. Oh, yeah. Look at that, baby. So we got us a banner. So I will get that up when, uh, when I got to cut the cameras to change scenes or something like that i'll try to get it up and um oh yeah that's gonna be nice thank you D, &D. i appreciate that the banner be beautiful we'll keep that in all of the build off videos another sticker oh we love stickers these are not brass parts so there's not going to be a bunch of extra added weight to the vehicle so i'm just going to go through them and as i grab them we'll look look at them so an 8290X, that'll be a motor mount, aluminum, blue, anodized. So that'll be nice. And then here we have some portal drive axle mount. This is 8256X, anodized blue. Yes, I did go blue. Here we have portal housings, inner, rear, 8253X anodized blue <laughs> here's some more 8251x portal housings outer anodized blue 
X. These are portal housings, inner front, anodized blue. <laughs> um, let's see, one more. These are 8232X, and these are caster blocks, anodized blue. All right, so let's see what else we have here. Now, I do need to get the... I'm not sure about these. I'm pretty sure. Oh, these are the um these are the lights for the LED Expedition Rack Scene Light Kit. That's what that is. 8086. Now, with that, I guess I have to show you this, which is the 8120X. And this is the Expedition uh, Expedition Rack complete includes all the accessories and all that stuff so that and then the light kit that'll go on here i'm pretty sure it goes on the sides somewhere so we'll figure that out next we have side mirrors and a snorkel this is 8119 mirrors side left and right and a snorkel so that's that and then we have a steering horn, 8247X, and it's just a metal steering horn. I just like that you can get all this stuff from Traxxas. All right, now with the new steering horn, we are getting a high torque 400 waterproof metal gear servo. Yeah! Where's the part number? I don't know if there is part numbers on here. I'm sure there is. There it is. Two two five five. Two two five five. This is the four hundred high torque servo. And because we're doing the servo, because we're doing the servo, we have a two two six two, which is a BEC complete. Includes receiver, box cover, and seals so you mount the bec on top of the receiver and then they give you a, a high top receiver box that'll go over top of everything i found another sticker in there thank you dnd put that in the bag all right and this is what else we're doing bam long arm lift kit long arm lift kit and of course anodized blue <laughs> so there's going to be a lot of blue on the truck. Uh, let's call it Project Big Blue. Project Big Blue. Now with that, we went and got some 2.2s. 8181. These are the tires and wheels already assembled and glued. Sport Wheels Canyon Trail 2.2 tires. 8181. So, alright, that would be nice. All right, so there you have it. There's all the stuff. So this is gonna be the unboxing video and the build video. So I'm gonna go ahead, we're not gonna unbox this. I showed you everything that's on here. I'm just gonna make it happen. One minute it's going to be sitting here like this and the next minute it'll be sitting here like this. All right, so we got all the hubs and portals and all that on. And then I realized that I did not get outer portal covers for the rear. So um, I got a hold of D&D, &D and he's going to order those for me. So next, I guess I'm going to do the lift kit and the links and all that. So when I come back, that'll be what's going on. All right, so this is where we're at with the truck. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Um... The lift kit is on there. All of the uh, all of the aluminum is on here. We have lift kit with all the links. Now these links aren't really what I consider to be anodized. They seem like there's something else. So and then you have the anodized aluminum. Get that to focus. Come on now. There you go. And then 2.2 uh, rims and tires. And then the uh, 
aftermarket servo. Well, not aftermarket, but the Traxxas upgraded servo. Let me see if I can't clear that up for you. And then we still have to do the BC. Um, the light kit and the adventure rack. I'm not sure. I'm still waiting on the light kit, but the there's a light kit that goes with the adventure rack. I'm not sure if I'm putting that on or, or not. We'll see. Um, <clears throat> let's see. What else? That's about it. Pretty basic. That's it. There's the first video. I did not use 30 weight oil in the shocks. I used uh, 17 and a half weight oil in the shocks. And um, I don't know. I might go a little lower than that. I'm not sure yet. So, but that's it for now. And I, like I said, I do have the adventure rack and uh, some other things to put on it. And so tune in next Wednesday and you'll find out if I put the adventure rack and all that stuff on it. Um, and if not, we'll do the, uh, we'll do the first challenge and we'll see what's going on. Axiomatic. I mean, he builds all of his stuff. I never, you never see him run it. You never see him run it. So I'm not worried. This, this little baby's going to do it. I, th I think it's just because it's blue. That's, that's what I think's going on. Like red, it gets in there and there's like little gremlins that go along with the red pigment of paint. So <laughs> you can't, you can't win. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Be sure to go watch Axiomatic's video because I'm sure he's going to say something about me. <laughs> All right, everybody. Let's have some fun with this. Five weeks of build off. Let's do this. Be good to people. People be good to you. Ben, out.